Okay, I am here on a uh, overcast, uh, rainy, but very cool and breezy day at uh, Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Um, I have to wait for the cod to come out. Look at they massacred the damn codfish. Oh my God, look at that. I have to, I have to choose an alternative. Anyway, I'm here at the Mongolian Barbecue. And they're fully stocked with supplies for food. Yes, believe it or not, people do sometimes choose uh, eggs on their Mongolian barbecue. Okay, now, where was I? I think I better get the, uh, I think I saw a succulent duck. Oh, my favorite, my favorite sign. Please don't touch with your hand. What's this? Uh, chicken teriyaki. Uh, veal sausage. <coughs> Crab meat pie? Where is this? Oh, that's it. Um, you know what I'll do? Let me grab this before somebody sucks it up. I love it. I love it. What do we got? Oh, shrimp and crab soup. Shrimp and crab soup is back, baby. Two weeks in a row. She laughing. She laughing over there? No, oh, I thought my, my favorite waitress was laughing. Laughing at me. Because I'm taking a video? No. Well, I don't know about succulent, but... some drumsticks which is actually on a bird is actually the calf uh, you know I don't know if birds have a soleus and gastrocnemius muscle uh, with their you know on their on their calf uh, configuration uh, Commodore Jeff Zambello I want to give a shout out to Commodore Jeff Zambello and the uh, exorcist Bishop Ryan from the hit show on the Travel Channel called Ghost Adventures. I want to give both of them a shout out. Um, God willing, I will see uh, Jeff Zambello, all natural drug-free power a lifter and competitive kettlebell practitioner. He has an event in Pennsylvania this summer and I look forward to seeing him again because I will accompany him this time with my wonderful Sony 18.3 I'm trying to talk above the noise hold on let me get out of here this guy's rude as hell my Sony 18.3 megapixel camera I will be accompanying Jeff Zambella the, the Gavon the Gavon makes all this noise I'm trying to do it. Yeah, the, the guy's making a lot of noise, man. On purpose, on purpose. Just to bust, just to bust James P. Madonna's chops, you know what I mean? Okay, I gotta decide what kind of fish I'm gonna have. Because the cod, the codfish is, uh, Codfish was massacred. It's funny how people dive, they nose dive right in for the cod. Hey, these, these look pretty good. Alright, I gotta decide on something because right now I just have a little bit of duck. The duck that's out of luck. What the hell am I gonna have? Uh, you know what? I'll have some bullion base. Gotta zoom in on my favorite sign again. They massacred the codfish. 
going to ask him right now for the car. Yeah, the car. The people massacre the car every, every week gone. I come here. It's gone. They, like, they dive in it like vultures uh, I saw in the desert the, last year. Where the hell's... They massacre. See, yeah, a lot of people agree with me. They, they look like paisans. No. What kind of low main is this? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, there's no chow mein foon. There's no angel hair rice in it. Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting these outer slices of mango simply because this contains the hairy seed in the middle and I don't want the fibers of the seed getting caught in between my teeth. Okay, even though they do look big and plump, there is a hairy seed in the center of that, of this, okay? Just a little mango education for you jabronis out there. some kiwi fruit here kiwi with mango see I like what they did here to make it easier to cut this the hairy fuzzy well the fuzzy skin off the kiwi you know they made um they created a bald spot which is very clever huh? I called this the bald-headed Larry Fine style kiwi fruit. A very clever system of peeling the fuzzy skin off a kiwi. Larry Fine bald-headed kiwi system. This is James P. Madonna from the Facebook group Everything is Food, Mega Life 21 and Progressive Discussions. And the inventor of Fandango Friday. Okay, now it's time for shrimp and crab soup. Always stir the bottom. Always stir the bottom when you, before you scoop the soup. Before you scoop, before you scoop the soup. What is it with these kids are so loud, interfering with my video? Anyway, like I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted. Always scoop the soup. You understand? Always scoop the soup because gravity causes all the morsels to settle to the bottom. I know I said that in the past and uh, I cannot overemphasize that scientific fact. Now, I don't have room for cockles. But, on the other hand, I could get I could get some cockles. Uh, what's a good cockle cup? Commodore Jeff Zambella. Should I get it? Should I use beige? I don't know. Should I use beige? I don't know what color would you use? Crab and, crab and shrimp. Crab and shrimp soup. I think I'm going to use beige. Cockles of my heart, the cockles of my heart, Jeff Sandow. Give it a... There you go. Oop. Okay, here we go. I'm going to have to terminate 
a video recording because I am going to require two hands to carry these two. All right. Okay, here I am at the table with uh, crab and shrimp soup with cockles, clams, cockles and crab and shrimp soup. Here at Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Okay, here we are again for the very best of hot buffalo chicken wings for your next sporting event at home. Come in and buy in bulk these hot buffalo chicken wings to go. The finest buffalo chicken wings from Royal Hibachi Buffet. It could be any sporting event at all. It doesn't matter. For your next sporting event party okay get the hot buffalo chicken wings to go at royal hibachi buffet rule 46 west saddlebrook new jersey this has been a mega life 21 production